Bella Luna by Janelle Cannon. <sighs> oh, hello. Welcome to Living Books. This is the story of a young fruit bat. Me. My name is Stella Luna. If you want to have my book read to you, click over here. To have a story read and play inside it, click over here. To learn more about bats, click here. Okay, let's go. In a warm and sultry forest, far, far away, there once lived a mother fruit bat and her new baby. Oh, how Mother Bat loved her soft, tiny baby. I'll name you Stella Luna, she crooned. Stella Luna. I love you, Stella Luna. I love you. Uh. 
Each night, Mother Bat would carry Stella Luna clutched to her breast as she flew out to search for food. Hold tight, Stella Luna. It's time to eat. One night, as Mother Bat followed the heavy scent of ripe fruit, an owl spied her. On silent wings, the powerful birds swooped down upon the bats. <gasps> Hang on, Stella Luna. Dodging and shrieking, Mother Bat tried to escape. But the owl struck again and again, knocking Stella Luna into the air. Her baby wings were as limp and useless as wet paper. Down, down she went, faster and faster, into the forest below. Stella Luna! The dark, leafy tangle of branches caught Stella Luna as she fell. One twig was small enough for Stella Luna's tiny feet. Wrapping her wings about her, she clutched the thin branch, trembling with cold and fear. Mother? Stella Luna squeaked. Where are you? Mother, I, I'm scared. By daybreak, the baby bat could hold on no longer. Down, down again she dropped. <coughs> Plump! Uh. Stella
Bella Luna landed headfirst in a soft, downy nest, startling the three baby birds who lived there. Stella Luna quickly clambered from the nest and hung out of sight below it. She listened to the babble of the three birds. What was that? What? 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 I don't know, but it's hanging by its feet. That's a strange looking bird. No tail feathers? How weird. I don't remember seeing this bird before. Let's take a closer look at it. You go first.